Happy Saturday, guys. Welcome back to the channel. Glad to have you here like always. Today, we have to head to the farm. We have so many things that we have to build out there. There's so much that needs to get done. But before I head out there, there's a couple things that I have to do here at the house. Things that I've been procrastinating for, I don't know, three weeks or more. Still, from the finch breeding season, so many things that I have to clean. Cages that need to get cleaned. I still have these. I don't know if you guys remember the video that I did on these two flights that I built for the finches. I never got them done. I just haven't had any time. Nest boxes that need to get cleaned. I got the water system down here. If you guys remember the video that I did on the water system for the finches, all of these things need to get cleaned. See all of the little valves, all the stuff is in there, needs to get cleaned out. These are things that I've spent so much money on and they are just, sitting out here getting messed up i got more nest boxes in here this is the bucket that i use to clean everything i pretty much just fill it up with water fill it up with either nest boxes food cups whatever it is put some clorox in there and then just wait for it to clean out wait about a day or so then pull it out and put it away i had to go feed the parrots real quick clean that room out as well there's so... i'm so tired it seems like every weekend you know what next week I'm going to the beach. Don't expect a video from me. You guys can see how messy this room is. I mean, kind of. It's not that bad, but it's messy. I gotta get it cleaned up. Can you tell that I don't know how to sweep? All right, these are all clean. Now I just gotta put them out to dry. Once they dry up, box them up, put them away for the following season, and then start on the next batch inside of the barrel to clean them out. Finally, we're back at the farm. Let's get to work. But before we start work, I got something I wanna show you. You guys wanna see my gobbler? Don't, don't be dirty. I'm talking about a turkey. Check these guys out. So we have two boys and one girl, and we're gonna go ahead and introduce them to the flock here. Here's another project that needs to get done. I need to finish enclosing this whole entire thing so that the birds don't get attacked by any predators or anything. This last pair over here, something happened to the female or the male. I'm not sure which one's which, but I'll show you. You can see that something grabbed it by the foot. Now, I'm not sure if it's because it's bickering with its mate if we take a look at the mate, I don't know if it's a female or the male, the other one. It kind of has some blood on it, so I don't know if he or she has been attacking this one right here. But they have eggs in the nest, so I'm not sure. I don't see why they would attack each other. But this definitely needs to get finished off. There isn't enough light hours in the day to get everything done, but we're going to try to get as much done between today, Saturday, and tomorrow, Sunday. But before we start working, we have to head to the pig pen real quick and separate one of the hogs that's with a female. I've been trying to get some little piglets, so let's go in there and separate them. I'm not too excited about doing that. I don't trust that pig. I think that pig likes to bite people, so let's see how it goes. that on video because you looked a little scared. I was scared. <laughs> These things are big. Last thing I need is to get bitten by a pig. 
in a farm there's always things to do when the next project is completely closing this <laughs> completely closing the parrot enclosure there she is trying to take the mesh for the, for the parrot so what we're going to be doing is completely closing that thing off so that they don't get attacked by any predators or anything that's the next project that's what we're going to try to tackle right now It's the end to another beautiful day here at the farm. We were able to get a couple things done. Seems like it wants to rain, but luckily no rain. We were supposed to get it around 2 p.m. It's seven o'clock now, so we're gonna head home. But that gave us a chance to kind of finish a couple things that we needed to do, like this enclosure. We were able to get the mesh all the way around. This is chicken wire. It still needs some things. Like for example, you see right here, it's not completely connected to the bottom one. So we gotta connect all these pieces. We gotta finish the top. But that's gonna be enough to stop predators from coming in and attacking any of these birds. And it's also gonna stop any of the birds from escaping if we ever accidentally leave a door open. So it is a great thing to do to any enclosure to protect your animals. So we'll be back tomorrow to get that finished. It's day number two here at the farm. I'm not sure if we're gonna get a chance to finish everything because it seems like it wants to rain. We were able to start on the roof. We got the backside done. Now all we need to do is just this front side right here, the triangle section on that wall and then the front side so let's try to get done as much as we can and kind of finish this video this thing's getting long I'm not gonna lie, it feels good not working for once and having an employee do your hard work. And the turkeys are just kinda hanging out here. They like to stay close by. They're keeping an eye on us, just making sure we're doing a good job. Yeah. Wait, you talking about me or the mesh? Oh. That's it. I'm done for the day. It's uh, seven o'clock Sunday, and um, pretty much everything got covered up with the mesh, clamped it down like you saw earlier, ended up clamping down the bottom and the uh, top mesh with these little tiny hog rings that you see right here. Did the same exact thing for the roof. Now all we're missing is just this triangle that you see right up here. And then when we move all the way to the front where the door's at, I have to try to figure that out. But uh, that also has to get completely enclosed, this section right here with the door. But I'm gonna go ahead and, um, and head out.
I'm tired. It's been a long weekend. We'll see each other in the next video. Bye.